to go bow for the result, oh. Nothing to discuss, oh. Cause I'm the poor wife, fault, and without any doubt, oh. I'm a me, happy adult, oh. I look off it. Welcome, Welcome back, back to, get to Getting, getting to, to Know the Ground. It's your girl, Keanu. And I'm KD. And if you are new to the channel, then welcome guys. We're in St. Martin today. In St. Martin. We just got off of the cruise ship and now we're trying to figure out what to do. What to do. So if y'all ever come here off of a cruise, we're going to show y'all what we're going to be getting into today. Y'all follow us. Yeah. We're going to show y'all what to do. Yeah. As soon as you get off the ship, they got the water taxi to the left and then they have the actual taxis to the right so we're getting ready to see what the swoop is <laughs> see what to do we were gonna do an excursion but then we really thought about it we're only gonna be on this island for maybe about eight hours and we want to get to see a whole lot of stuff and nothing is wrong with doing an excursion but we didn't just want to do an excursion and that's it we really want to explore this island just to see if we want to come back here so far this island is really beautiful so what you're looking at here are the different beaches that are in St. Martin and the cost of the fare is in USD so y'all feel free to screenshot this or take a picture. They also had different round trip tours and they had where you can actually customize your own tour. Now what we ended up doing was the three hour island sightseeing tour and our driver took us around the entire island and she also allowed for us to get out, take pictures, videos, whatever we wanted to do. And our driver's name was Lisa. This is her right here. She was very pleasant, y'all, and she was very, very knowledgeable. We asked her so many questions. When y'all speaking to each other, do y'all speak patois? Uh, we speak, not patois, we speak, we speak different. A little quicker, so mm -hmm. it's like a little twang, but it's, it's, it's English. Oh, okay, gotcha. We, just, we speak a little faster, we're broken. Most oh. of them is tourism, so they speak a lot of English now. But we always spoke English here. It, it's the most common language here. Okay. And then I have another question too. So, being that the, the island is uh, separated with the Dutch and the French, is it because they both colonized it at some point and they, and they came and... They both discovered at the same time. Oh, okay. So they just negotiated amongst each other to what, who gets what. That side you get the port entry for the two ships. The Dutch side you also have the international airport. So it seems like everything is pretty much on the Dutch side huh. for the most part. Here's the Dutch side, y'all, and then we're on the French side right now. Easter Bay Resort and the Lighthouse. It belongs to Oyster Bay as well. Oh, okay. Okay. Right over here. Mm -hmm. That's the water looks that so same pretty. Bars. You see that island there? It's part of the French. And there, we have um, every year from December month, we have all the celebrities there. Beyonce, Jay Z, all the big celebrities. December 31st, that's where they keep the big party. <laughs> if y'all can see way out in the distance back there. Wow. Yeah, that's where they keep the party every year. Every 31st. Mm -hmm. No, Beyonce probably taking you, it. Whatever yeah. celebrities you can think about, they're over there. Wow. <laughs> so this is one of the stops that we end up hopping out on. I can't remember what our driver said the name of the spot was, but this is very popular, and a lot of people come here to take pictures, enjoy the scenery, just kick back, have some drinks and stuff, and um, we really ain't want to go, you know, like, we was just taking pictures and, and, and catching the scenery, like, right in this area here, as you can see. Oh, and also, a lot of people come here to go fishing and stuff as well, so that's another thing if you were to come here. Maybe when you have a driver, they could tell y'all exactly what this was, but we loved it. What did you say the population was again? The population is about a half a million. That's on both sides. That's a lot of people. I wish y'all known dish. Is it just mostly like Caribbean food, Caribbean food? Mm -hmm. Like rice and peas, mm -hmm. jerk, mm -hmm. curry. Stew chicken, curry chicken, oxtail. Now that's, yeah, that oxtail. <laughs> uh -huh. mm -hmm. You know, I never had oxtail. Steamed fresh, you know, oh, all that man. stuff. I never had oxtail. oxtail. Amazing. You never had oxtail? It never. You're missing out half of your life. <laughs> yes. 
especially if it's by the right people. See, if you ain't even from the islands, I don't even want no oxtail. Like back home, if you be sounding like me, it sound like I don't know. But when it is, man, what you want, man? Yeah, you want yeah, jack? Yeah. I be like, yeah. <laughs> Right there. The junk, I want that one. All that stuff. I know. Uh-huh. <laughs> I know. Because they know how to do it. They know. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Definitely. I had a spot back home that I used to go to, uh, Jamaican food. And Jam they Rock. Jam Rock. And they yeah. end up closing down during COVID. It hurt oh, my heart. Because okay. I used to go to them all the time. Well, there's a, there's a, there's a restaurant in Mario in the capital. Mm hmm There's a lady there. She cooks one I told you. She's real good. She's mm hmm her name is Rosemary. Rosemary, okay. Her restaurant wow. named Rosemary's. So now we enter into the capital of the French side, the Mary Go. Okay, y'all. So Lisa talked about Rosemary so much that we had to come and see what the hype was all about. Mm-hmm. Now let's get us something to eat. It looks amazing. Yeah. We're sharing this meal, so I'm getting ready to go ahead and make my plate, y'all. This food looks too good. And is this an oxtail too? Yeah. So, so what do I? Let me see the bone in the middle. Try these oxtails. It's really good. Yo, I say you might not get the uh, real feel because it's like a small. It tastes good though. Yeah. It tastes good. Well, they might do it different. Let me try the rice and beans. So we just found that it's carnival time right now. I wonder um, what time they start. Maybe in the evening, I would think. So we'll probably miss all of that. That's why y'all hear all of that going on in the background. This is good too. They make their rice and peas different, but I like it. This food is good. Look at this, I wasted it on my hand. That's when you know food is good. And then let me try the curry dough. Here's the curry dough. This hot sauce. This is the hot sauce. I just want to try it. It looks good. I just want to try a little bit of it. I can tell it's habanero peppers. I can tell it's super hot. It's super hot. It's habanero peppers. Well, I got water. Hot sauce. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, I told you that's a, that's a, a, a have a new, uh, Oh my god. This is hot. Most of the house is made of no, 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 those stone. Are blocks, concrete. Oh concrete. Yeah. Okay. And as you can see, most of the roofs are paved. Right. Same concrete. It's because we're in the Caribbean. We're in the path of hurricanes. Right. So, you know, the hurricanes come off the coast of Africa mm -hmm. and we're right in the part of, of the hurricanes. So, oh, okay. So that's, that's it. Why, okay, I didn't know that. They come that's why the we coast build strong Africa. like that, yeah. Okay. They come off the coast of Africa, yeah. That's where most of them come from. Right, right. Some, you know, off sometimes you get some come from the other way, but it's mm -hmm. mostly coast of Africa and up. So basically we was just talking to our tour guide and she was telling us that where we are now is the regular beach and if we were to go over to the other side, which is like a few steps down, that's the new beach. And she said mostly like old people and stuff be over there, but we were just like, oh man, it's crazy. But <laughs> yeah, I was like, yeah, we staying far away from that one. Oh my God. So this Orient. is Orient Bay, Bay beach. beach. And then they got the water sports back here. If y'all can see. So this right here is the French side airport. It's a small airport and it's used for island hopping. What I wanted to know, I, I see it yeah, spelled different, different ways. Oh. Okay. S T dot, then you got M T 
double A R T E N. Oh, okay. The front side is Saint with S A I N T. Uh -huh. Right. Martin, which is M one A R T I N. Oh, okay. okay. And then I've also seen it, maybe it was misspelled, but I seen uh with two E's. I've seen that too. Misspelled. Okay, so oh, that's that's misspelled. okay, so that's yeah, misspelled. That's misspelled. Okay. So it's two A's. So we go that way to get the lottery farm, and then yes. you said they have zip lining, a natural, a natural pool, pool. Yeah, bars. bars, bars, just a bunch of fun activities. Yes. Okay, yeah. and you said that it's good like, just to spend your whole day there. Yes. Right. Lottery farm. So if you ever come to St. Martin, I was about to say St. Lucia. If you ever come to St. Martin, just make sure you come to Lottery, lottery farm. farm. What's the legal age to drink here? 18, but I think 18. they want 18. to adjust it to 21. Mm -hmm. It's 18 now, but they, they, they want to adjust it to 21. And over here on the front here is where you get the ferry to either go to Anguilla or to go to St. Mark's. Oh, right okay. Right over there, straight ahead. Yeah. How you did that? You got fresh stones in the world, watch you. How you did that? You hear some stunts in your closet, why you did that? How you yelling, slash, slash. Everybody's sitting here waiting for the plane to come. So we're at the famous Maho Beach. And Maho it's Beach. Basically, where the planes fly really, really close to you, right over your head. The airport is right behind us. One is coming in. Coming in. Yeah, you can see that. Oh. So there's a plane coming in right now. Right there. And he's headed. This one looks like it's going to go right over our heads. Delta. We got a few more minutes and then we gotta go back to the ship. Right now we're here at the Milano Diamond Gallery with our buddies Alex and Harish. And they showed us a great time. We just had some champagne. And you know, they just been a great help, man. Shout out to Harish and Alex, man. These guys are amazing. They really are, man. They really are. Come get one of these. I think we're gonna go ahead and wrap up this vlog for today. We just leave in the famous Maho Beach and we're about to get on the ship. So I hope you all enjoyed this vlog. Make sure y'all like, comment, and, and subscribe, subscribe. And we will see y'all at the next destination. Peace. Bye.